Hey, Ty is out at Rise Up Bakery in Gilbert, uh, baking up some baked goods. I assume maybe something for the morning. Breads? Yeah. Well, you know, they they have literally everything, Renee. I wish that someone out there would invent smell a vision because I am not joking. When you come in here, it smells incredible. Look at this. I'm on the other side of the display case here. This is where they show off all of their delicious sticky buns, cinnamon rolls. This is what they're famous for. But then look at all of these delicious pastries, cupcakes, cookies, you name it. They have got it all. And the man behind it all is JJ. Thank you so much for having us. Hi. This is so Welcome much fun. To our bakery. I love this. I love a good bakery. Tell for people that don't know, how long have you guys been in business? So we've completed six years. We're going on our seventh year right now. Congratulations! Yep. And you were talking about it, and I was uh, drooling on it. Drooling on it. I wasn't drooling on it. Drooling <laughs> over it, I should say. All of your cinnamon rolls. These are what you guys are really kind of on the map for. Right. We're on the map for cinnamon rolls. Our icing uh, is uh, really popular. Popular. All of our flavors, we have different icings for each one. Sure. My and personal favorites are lemon blueberry. Ooh. This is our cream cheese icing for our regular cinnamon roll. Then we, this is our newest item right there at the macadamia nuts on there. We decided to bring some Hawaii. I want to go to Hawaii. It's for my wife last week. I want to go to Hawaii again. Me too, Jay. So it has uh, chocolate chunks inside, and that's what we're going to make right now, chocolate chunks. And then it has a coconut icing with uh, macadamia nuts on Wow. There. Okay, so you start with your, your dough here, and then... So I got the dough out, and then what we do is we... Can I help you yep, spread it out? Spread that out. Okay. Yeah. Now, how and thick are we going here? Well, if uh, the, it's, it's on our level three of our... Uh, I don't know the exact dimensions. Level three out of that. what? Five? <laughs> no, on our, on our nice little uh, machine oh, oh, over oh. here. Oh, oh, oh. Gotcha, gotcha. And then... Uh, I thought we were talking about cinnamon. Oh, level. the cinnamon. I thought you were talking <laughs> about the dough. How funny. No, no good. So then... Add uh, some chocolate chunks. We have the chocolate chunks. And I'm not overdoing it for the camera. We really do put this much... This much chocolate in. Chocolate on everything. Wow, that's like two and a half cups. Three, right? Yep, it's almost a pound of chocolate a for pound of chocolate. 24 cinnamon rolls. Now, I'm going to let you do this part because this looks like the tricky part, the the actual physical rolling. Oh, that's not, okay. So, no, it's not too bad. You can cut one if you want. I guess it okay. depends on the time. But uh, then we roll these up. We get these out of the oven every morning at 7 o'clock. Yeah, I was going to say, uh, you kind of have our hours on the morning show. What time do you get here? Yeah, well, I uh, we get here around 4.30. 4.30, okay. It's not too bad. I get plenty of sleep. I go to bed in time to get up to <laughs> There you go. Too, yes, right? you, get, you have to. So I don't want to be too grumpy or anything. No. Okay, we've got about a minute left. Can we come over here and cut that one so yep. show everybody kind of once it's all done what this bad boy looks like inside? So this is what our... Uh, Cinnamon, this is our newest item. We have a seasonal item at all times. Oh, look at that. And then uh, this is our seasonal item. We'll do raspberry, apple. We'll be doing peaches when peaches come out. Yeah. And uh, we have other different flavors like pumpkin, depending on time of year. Jay, I'm going to dig into this. While I'm doing that, you tell folks where you're located. So we're located on the northeast corner of Higley and Guadalupe. That is... That's insane. I That's am really smiling, good. just so you know. No, I I'm smiling too, but I just want to keep shoving this in my mouth. This is fantastic. Jay, we're going to hang out with you because you not only have the bakery, but delicious sandwiches. I feel so rude talking with my mouth full, but well, if, if we're going to come sharing, back in about 20 minutes from so. If you're sharing, it's Thank not you for coming. Ty, but it's the sharing well, hey, part. I didn't say I was sharing yet. You, yeah. you are, right? I haven't agreed to sharing just yet. Oh, well, that's fantastic. If you're nice, if you're nice, Renee, I might bring you back one. Okay. I'll try harder. <laughs> I think. AZAM is back. Welcome back. Ty Brennan is live at Rise Up Bakery, but they have so much more than just baked goods. Good morning, Ty. Good morning. They sure do. They have delicious baked bread. There's nothing better than fresh baked bread. Jay, what type of breads do you guys have here? Most of our breads are on the healthy side. They're usually five ingredients, the wheat, water, honey, salt, and yeast, and nothing else. Nothing else. I love that. Right? And we're looking at all the fresh baked breads. How many, how, could you even estimate how many loaves you guys make uh, in a day? We make about that much in a day here. Wow. Uh, yeah. Now, you were saying that when you first started this bakery, you were just going to do bread, but then that's when you started to 
branch off into the pastries, and that's what really kind of put you guys on the map. Right. The bakery I had in Las Vegas, we for 10 years, I supplied Costco and Sam's Club, and I was going to do that when we moved out here. Then I really wanted to be the neighborhood bakery. I'm, I'm a people person. I want to see everybody. So we decided to focus on pastries here and walk-in customers, and it's been great ever since. And Jay, what I love, too, is that you get to actually, you have a whole deli, so to speak, kind of in the back, so you get to try the bread. We started this last year. We're going to start featuring it a little bit more. I think right now we're making you a vegetarian sandwich. Yes. Lou, look at that. And, and then that's a lot of avocado. If you're going back to the office, we potentially can take a sandwich uh, to them. We do clubs, and that is we put a half avocado half on there. an avocado like that is my f look at that that looks insane she is a sandwich artist that is for sure right there that is some good handiwork Jay, you guys are kind of entrenched here in the community. You've been here forever, right? Well, I grew up in Casa Grande. Um, went to, my dad was a high school teacher there. And my kids uh, went to Highland High School and Highland Junior. And we love this area. And so we purposely opened the bakery close to home. I love that. Okay, we've got about a minute left. But, Jay, you were telling me something that I thought was a genius idea. For some of the big holidays, you guys do a take and bake with some of your famous cinnamon rolls. Tell me about that. Right. Well, I started doing it, and it... I didn't know if it'd be popular or not. Now it's been a tradition for many people, Thanksgiving, Christmas. We do it Easter and potentially Mother's Day, where we have a tray of six uncooked cinnamon rolls. We have it bagged and frozen for you. All you do is if we give you instructions, we put it out, and then uh, you, you pull it out and bake it in the morning so you have fresh uh, cinnamon rolls coming out uh, in the oven. All right, Jay, let's walk over here. We've got just a couple seconds left. What, are your, what is your address once more so folks can find you? So we're on the northeast corner of Higley and Guadalupe in uh, Gilbert. Okay. We've got about 30 seconds left. Renee, Celeste, Corey, my treat. You guys choose what you want here. Wow. What is our lemon blueberry with lemon, lemon wow, blueberry? Our orange, so we do a lot of cinnamon rolls. Cinnamon rolls, calling my name. Our regular I cinnamon rolls. Yes. And uh, then the these traditional. Are, uh, these are our new, yeah, the traditional. And these are our new coconut so chocolate. You yes. got 10 uh, seconds yes. left. You better call Corey will have Corey will have some of that cheese bread. Five. So, something amazing. They're not getting anything. Thanks. All right, I'll give you a.